This tutorial will explain how to use a cloak and mic warp drive to navigate kinda safely through a hostile gate camp. At least as long as there's no bubbles involved, because then it just doesn't work, of course. Um, if you jump into a hostile gate camp, um, either high sec or low sec or unbubble zero zero wormholes, um, and you have a very small, fast ship, you can most of the times you can get away. But in the bigger ship, um, it might be an issue. I'm flying a battleship here, which has no fittings other than a micro drive uh, cloak and some cap recharges. Um, so if there would be a hostile camp on the other side, I probably wouldn't make it. It's not going to happen. So how does this work? Well, if you jump through a gate, you have gate cloak. This lasts 60 seconds. Not 30 seconds, but most people think it's 60 seconds. During that 60 seconds, you cannot be uncloaked in whatever form or way. Ooh, thank you, mate. Um, so what you then try to do, you have all the time to to pick, pick an exit strategy, and then you want to warp somewhere. The problem is that if you then click warp or align or whatever, you will be uncloaked, and it, it will take you, in this case, about 10 seconds to align. It's not going to work. So would you be able to do that, that aligning while you're cloaked? Um, that would help a lot. The problem is, if you check cloaks, and you need to use a Tech 2, tech two cloak for this, uh, uh, tech one named cloaks don't work. You need to have this improved cloaking device. Um, it has a speed penalty. Uh, where is it? Maximum velocity penalty is 75%. So right now my maximum speed is 126. If I enable the cloak, which I can't do because I'm too close to the gate. Let me solve that real quick. Um, it will be a whole lot less. Um, so you can't really get away that way. Um, you can cloak up and they can't, you know, target you while you're cloaked, but you're not w warping off just yet. And if you try to uncloak and get then warp, you have the same issue you had before, so it doesn't really work. Let's have a look. Yes. My top speed is now... Hold on a second. 31.5. Yeah, that's not handy. So that's not going to do anything. Uh, I'm now cloaked. I'm kind of sort of safe till they uncloak me, but would it w w want to warp away? I have to uncloak, in which case, as I said, I'm, we're back to square one. Doesn't work. So to help with that, you have a micro warp drive fitted. So what you want to do is, as you're trying to align while you're cloaked, your micro warp drive is helping you to negate the penalty of the cloak. And after um, the, the cycle of micro drive ends, because as you cloak, you only have what the initial cycle, only one cycle, um, you uncloak and you warp away. The thing is that most people um, have this... No, it's, it's, it's kind of correct, but think that you cannot activate anything if you're cloaked. That's not entirely true, because a few seconds after cloaking, you can still activate your micro warp drive. Trust me, you'll see. I'm going to use the F1 and F2 keys here, just to make it easier on me. And I'll show you what happens. I'm going to jump through this gate. Jump through this gate. Let's assume there's all kinds of red crap going on here, and I'm not... I don't really want that crap. Okay, I'm going to pick a target to warp to. Do not pick a planet that's very close to you, like this one. This is just like 40k, uh, 40,000 kilometers. That's going to cause issues. I can't explain why, but it takes way too much time. Just pick something further away. Or in this case, actually pick. That's also... No, a gate is good. Just not a planet. Okay, so I'm going to hit a line. Cloak. My warp drive, wait out my cycle timer, uncloak, and warp. Here we go. Align, cloak, my warp drive. As you can see, it activates just fine after cloaking. I'm going to watch this cycle as it ends. I'm going to hit F1. I'm already mashing the warp button. Nothing happens till I hit F1, and I uncloak, and I'm off. There we go. Completely safe. The only issue you might have is that they uncover you as you um, um, do the aligning cloaked. This can happen. Uh, chances 
Um, if they're good, yes. If they're the average idiot, probably not. Let's try this again. Jump through. Pick a target to warp to. Um, I'll pick this one. Don't know why I'll just pick it. Align, not warp. Align. Cloak. Micro warp drive. There he goes. Watch the cycle. Watch the cycle. Start clicking the warp button already. Doesn't matter. Just do it. Just end here. And as it ends, just hit F1. And you're gone. Very easy, really. That's it.